Hi, this is Andy with wristadvisor.com, and today we have a very special review for you. We got our hands on, uh, and it's just released, the Olympic 2022 Omega Special Edition, the Omega Seamaster 300 meter. So today I am wearing the uh, black dial, black ceramic bezel variation. I want to put it right here and, and I'll hold it side by side so you guys can see that in a minute. But I want to be able to take this out of the box uh, and give you guys a really good view of this thing. Um, if you guys are interested, um, I'm not going to go into so much of the details and specs of this watch as I did with uh, the video that I did on this one. Uh, you can go to the YouTube video. Um, I'll have a link in the description below. Uh, but this video, I want to highlight uh, what's different about this watch, um, what makes it special, and uh, how you can get a hold of it. So uh, I got hands-on with this uh, from the guys at Moyer Fine Jewelers. They uh, let us have this for a couple days to, to get hands-on and uh, really get an opinion and uh, do this review for you guys, And th which brings me to my next point. Uh, you know, if you guys like these videos, it really does help to like and subscribe because it helps us get hands-on with these watches. So let's we'll just get into it. Uh, let's put this thing on the wrist. As you can see, um, you know, in, in the lighting and, and even in regular regular light too, uh, this has a very deep navy blue dial. And I'm, I'm trying to, to get a really good image for you right here. Uh, this ceramic dial makes it somewhat hard sometimes, uh, the way light plays off of it, to see it on camera. But uh, in person, it looks really good. I think that you guys are, are somewhat getting a really good color of it right here. Very, very, very sharp on the watch. So like I said, Omega is the official timekeeper of the Olympics. They are for as long as I can remember. It's going to be the Winter Games are going to be in Beijing in 2022. And Omega just came out with this to uh, to celebrate it and have it be a special edition for the 2022 Games. It's no surprise, uh, at least to me, that they did it on the Seamaster 300 meter. This watch is getting tons of love, just the collection in general. Uh, from content creators and, and, and buyers, you know, as far as I can see, you know, like I said, I'm one of those people. I bought one um, about six months ago, absolutely fell in love with it. I probably wear this more than I wear anything else. So, you know, great job, Omega, listening to the market, listening to uh, to the fan base and, and giving them a really cool limited edition um, for something that's very special like the Olympics. So there are some things that are different about this watch, and it's not just the dial. We have some uh, subtle um, uh, changes to the to the um, not not the the base blue of the dial, but the indices on the dial. So as you can see, at the two o'clock we have a red, at the four o'clock we have a green, at the eight o'clock we have a yellow. The blue is going to be at the ten. And I don't know if you're going to see it, but right here at the 12, it's black. And those are the official ring colors of the Olympics. And you can see it right here in all of those positions. So you can tell that Omega has put some creative work into this. Now, one thing that is, uh, you know, I don't, I don't know if you would call it an upgrade. It, I guess it's all preference. Uh, and it's very obvious the bezel is going to be different than it is on the regular Omega Seamaster 300 meter. So this one is what Omega calls a grade five titanium. So it is going to be very, very, very durable. Um, the titan the introduction of the titanium uh, does have this watch, and I'm sure a little bit special edition, but uh, not so much. This watch sells for a little bit more than the regular one. The original Seamaster 300 meter uh, has an MSRP of 5,200. This has an MSRP of $6,150. Um, we have a, a special case back for this. It uh, commemorates the, the Beijing 2022 Olympic Games. On the original one, we get to see the movement on this, and these both share the same movement. It is the caliber 8800 Omega. It is the in-house. It's the one that has the anti-magnetic resistance um, up to 15,000 gauss. It has the 55-hour power reserve. 
and it has the coaxial escapement. So, you know, this watch is definitely going to be uh, something that it's going to be a while before you, you ever take it in for service just because the way that the movement is built. Uh, very quality watch. Like I said, I love the original. If you are someone who is into limited editions, if you are just really into the Olympics, if you know someone that's in the Olympics, I mean, these are going to be uh, really hot watches. Um, I expect for these to be very hard to find in, in the near future, especially with the watch market as it is today. Uh, it seems like everything is just really, really, really hot right now. Um, so overall impression, uh, you know, I, I think this watch is phenomenal. Uh, it, it takes the the original and not just I don't I don't know if I would say it's one step up, but it's just a different variation. And I think that might play to a different market. But overall, Mega has done a great job with the 300 meter collection. Uh, so if you're really into Olympics, if you know someone that's in it, uh, you know, I would definitely take a look at uh uh, th this watch as, as a gift to commemorate the special occasion. Um, and again, guys, this video has been awesome. I can't believe that I got hands on with this watch. Um, if you do like what we're doing, it does really help. Like I said, to like, and subscribe to the channel. I, I you know, sometimes I feel uncomfortable asking you guys about that, but it, it is what fuels this channel and helps us do more videos like these. And if you guys, uh, have a watch that you want to see, us do a review on, uh, make a comment down below. Let me know, you know, what you guys are interested in. You know, my goal is to be able to produce content that you guys are going to want to be able to consume. So, and, uh, just from seeing the metrics, you guys really like Omega. And, uh, that's why I was really excited that, uh, I could get this piece in and, uh, do a review for it. So thanks guys for joining us on this video and we hope to see you on the next one.